Damn, I guess someone broke the window. That's crazy. Ain't that a bitch? Yes, sir. Let's go, baby. <laughs> one bacon and egg and one sausage, egg and cheese? Yeah. Anything else for you? Uh, that's it. Yeah, can I get a um, strawberry uh, banana smoothie? coming through for your boy man this release was crazy today i struck out no first of all let's rewind let's rewind take it back to i think it was wednesday or thursday or whatever i had the early access um on my sneaker app so they reserved me an early pair i ordered that a few hours later during that same day, Nike sends me an email and tells me my order was canceled. I'm like, bro, how do you cancel a reserved pair? Whatever, whatever the case may be. I post that on Instagram. I'm like, bro, did it, anybody else get this message from Nike? It seems like a whole bunch of other people got it from Nike. So they reserved pairs, but then I guess they had too many shoes or did not have enough shoes and too many people ordered and they canceled a whole bunch of people ordered. So that happened. And then this morning, this shoe came out on the sneaker app. They sold out in like seconds, bro. Like, like literally, like at nine o'clock, the sizes were available, bro. All the big sizes were gone and like at nine o'clock at the dot. So man, I don't know what's going on with that, but that seemed kind of fishy, man. Like that, it, it, I, it, I don't know, man. That sneaker app just, it, it didn't feel right. So I struck out on the sneaker app and then I was like, God damn, man, I want these shoes. So then I went to footlocker.com and I looked at the location launcher and I seen that they had them at the gallery of mall. So I, I hauled ass over there. Woo! Luckily, I got on, man. These sold out like hotcakes, man. I'm just, ah! Uh, after all that BS with the sneaker app with Nike with the cancellation, your boy got it, dog. Your boy got the Kyrie's, dog. <laughs> I'm excited to see this, man. I have not opened up the box yet, but, man, as y'all see, Typical Kyrie 3, Kyrie 3, Kyrie 3, size 11 and a half. I always say in Kyrie's, you always want to go up a half size, even a full size maybe, because I'm a size 11, but I went with a size 11 and a half. I think this is my, four, I think this is my seventh pair of Kyrie's, man. This is my seventh pair of Kyrie's. Like I said, man, I fuck with Kyrie, man. I'm glad he left Cleveland. I'm glad he left LeBum James over there and he doing his own thing and he's killing shit right now in the Celtics and Boston and he's in the race for MVP. So I hope Kyrie take that MVP this year. I hope it's the uh, Celtics and the Warriors this year. But my Rockets are looking good too. Rockets is, is looking good. But man, James Harden, man, he be nutting up in the playoffs. So like... I'm not that confident in my Rockets because, like, they do this every year. Like, they good, and then when the playoff comes, they just trash. You know what I'm saying? So, I got to see it to believe it. You know what I mean? So, I would like, of course, to see uh, James Harden win a championship, but, you know, it's that other team, Golden State, that's pretty good. And James Harden nuts up like every single year in the playoffs. I'm just a realistic person. But anyway, enough about that. Woo! Let's talk about these bad boys right here, man. The Kyrie's, all right, man. Like I said, I have not opened up this shoe yet. I'm excited to see about this shoe, so let's check it out. Let's check it out. 
Yes, sir. So happy to add this to the collection. Yes, sir. All right, man. Let me just pull it out. Y'all ready? Bam! Man, oh man. The Kyrie one or two, three, all combined, hybrid. What this? Oh, dead, man. So like I always say, who gives up? Fuck about a box. Woo -hoo -hoo, man. These bad boys right here are so much better in hand, man. Where do I begin? Shit, I don't know where to begin because I really don't know much about the shoe as far as the detail. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. But I'm gonna try to do my best. All right, so, I mean, we got a whole bunch of colors, man. We got a whole bunch of colors, whole bunch of textures, whole bunch of different abstract art. So, uh, I don't know where to start. All right, so, we gonna start right here. Um, all right, so as you see, it says, what the, up here, we kinda, damn, what material is this? I don't know what material this is, so don't ask me, cause I don't know. <laughs> uh, but anyway, we got 1.5 steals. I guess that that's was his average. Um, we got 20.8, I have no idea what that stands for. I did not do my research on this shoe, but <laughs> we gonna make it do what it do. We got Kyrie right here. The strap has that kind of a cream, creamish, uh, I don't know what material this is. I don't know, bro. I, I really don't know. Uh, we got what the right here in the lettering. Man, dude, what is this material, bro? I don't know. I <laughs> this is gonna be the worst, in, uh, the worst detail review because I don't know what this shit stands for, to tell you the truth. I don't know what this, what is this? Bro, what is that? I don't know. Bro, this is, this is gonna be trash, man. Uh, we got this graphic picture right here, which looks like a bone. Maybe this is his fingers that he might have broke or something. I, I mean, bro. <laughs> I don't know shit about this shoe, bro. I really don't know shit about this shoe. I just know it's dope. I just know I like the colorway. We got the Kyrie one right here. On the, on, the, on the Kyrie Run, this is the back of the Kyrie Run right here. And as you see, the model shape is the Kyrie 2. And the bottom right here is also the Kyrie 1. And uh, shit, other than that, we got this pink, peach looking color. We got this blue. I'm guessing this is blue for Duke that he played for. And this black and blue, I'm guessing that's the colors of Duke as well. And check out the bottoms on deck. We got that Duke blue. And right here we got that clear circle with the Kyrie symbol on deck. What's that other? And there's another little J B Y? I think that's what that said. Behind that? I bro. <laughs> I don't know shit about this shoe, bro. Alright, then we got Elizabeth right here. If you a fan of Kyrie, you should know who Elizabeth is. And then we got the date right here, which is 8-13-67. You see it right there. And then on the other side, we got 9-8-96. So if y'all Kyrie fan, y'all should know who Elizabeth is, man. So, uh, shit. What else do I need to say about this shoe? Check out the front. Boom. We got that Kyrie. Looking nice with this brown front pull tab. And, um, shit, man, I don't know. <laughs> I, I can't tell you much about this shoe, because I don't really know. Uh, check out how it looks without the strap. A, a lot of people probably is gonna say this is trash, this is ugly. The what does always come with the weird abstract colors. And actually, all these colors look very good to me. I think this shoe came out very dope, very well. I like the colors. It seems like it's a lot going on, but it 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 matches everything, in my opinion. But check out the tongue. We got a little bit of, bro, like this material, it's, 
there's a lot of material on this shoe that I don't know what it is because I didn't do my research and I really don't care. If y'all really care that much, y'all can do your own research. I'm just giving you my gangster review, man. But anyway, these bad boys is nice, man. Definitely, definitely, definitely happy to add it to the collection. And yes, I will be throwing these on feet. And uh, let's check out the inside real quick. The inside on the back of the tongue has this autograph right there as you see and then in the inside you can see a handprint kind of a, like a x x-ray handprint maybe he broke his finger or I, I don't know yeah it seemed like he broke his two fingers right here because if you can look on the x-ray you can see two like missing gaps right there so i'm guessing he broke his finger right there but Kyrie always has a has a lot of injuries. So there's a whole bunch of other um, detail in here which you can't really see. But other than that, man, this is a dope, dope, clean shoe, man. So leave a comment down below. Let me know if you was able to cop these. These was a very hard shoe to cop because like I said, at nine o'clock, man, like all the shoes from 11 up, from size 11 and up, was all gone in like seconds. But like all the smaller sizes were still available. But I looked up and was able to, to, to cop these at my local Foot Locker, man. So these bad boys is clean. This is like my seventh or eighth Kyrie. I love Kyrie's dope shoes. Very cheap, very affordable price. These only retail for 130, man. And these, man, these are nice, man. But anyway, leave that comment down below. I'm trying to see if I need to point out anything else that I need to talk about, which I don't know about. Because yeah, I mean, bruh, this is a this is a dope shoe. I don't care what nobody says. I buy what I like, and I like what I buy. You feel what I'm saying? So yeah, man. Anyway, I'm about to put these bad boys on feet. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe. Enjoy this on foot video, baby. Peace. Make sure you go watch my other video that I posted earlier today. I posted two videos. The video that you just seen right now, and I posted an earlier video during the day. So make sure y'all go check that out. Click this little box link right here. It's gonna take you straight to that video, and you will see my prediction of if the win like 96s, are they gonna sit or are they gonna sell out? So make sure you go check that out. Click that link right here. Click that little link box and go check out that video, man. It's your boy DMD signing out.